What's up YouTube? This is Everything Apple Pro and this is a video I've been looking forward to make for a long time and it's going to show all iPhone, iPod Touch and iPad users how to run Game Boy Color and Game Boy games on their device. Now, this is just a must have for anyone that's ever played a Game Boy Color or Game Boy or just interested because it's a very well built emulator and it brings back a lot of memories for me because I played this a lot when I was smaller. Of course, you will need a jailbroken device on any firmware, it works on all firmwares, and you'll need Wi-Fi, and you'll need to know how to SSH. If you don't know how to SSH, I'll put a video annotation right here, click on that and watch it before proceeding because you will need to know how to do this. And don't worry, it's a very easy process, and that's pretty much it. So, once you've watched that video, just go ahead and open up Cydia, and wait for it to reload. Once it's done, you're going to want to search for Game Boy 4 and right there, Game Boy for iPhone. Click on in, install and confirm, and once you've done that, just exit to the springboard. And you should see this icon. Just If you click on it, you'll notice there are no games inside. I have a couple because I put them on here, and I'm going to show you how to do that right now with SSH and of course you'll need your device to be on and connected to Wi-Fi and log in I'll type in my password and once we're in you put that aside and you're gonna wanna go to a web browser most likely Mozilla is the best candidate and you're going to want to go to coolrom.com. Once you're there, you'll click on ROM files, or you won't click on it, but put your mouse over it. This drop down menu appears, and go to Game Boy Color, but I'm already here. And from here, you can pick out any game you want to install. It's compatible with pretty much every game. And I already downloaded Pokemon Gold, but I'll show you the process. You just click on it, and you'll wait a few seconds until the download link appears down here. and once you download it click download and save file do not open it with anything because it might disappear most likely but once you've got it downloaded open containing folder and open this and extract it to your desktop and if you don't have WinRAR I'll put a link down here where you can download it and I already have it but I'll copy and replace it and we can close these windows now and in the in the WinRAR file, in the zip file, you sh there should be a file either .gbc or .gb, and that's the one you want to extract, the biggest the biggest one, the biggest size. And you go back to your SSH session, and you're gonna want to click Backspace on your keyboard, and that'll take you to this long drop-down list. You'll want to go down to Mobile, Media, and open up ROMs. Now you'll have the ROMs folder when you download an emulator, and I have a bunch of them, but you're going to want to go into Game Boy and put that aside. Now just drag in the ROM that you want to install on your device and copy, but I already have it, but I'm going to click yes, just replace it. It'll only take a second, and once it's done, just end your session, and that's it. Now when you go to your iPod Touch, just click on the icon. You should see your game appear right away. If it doesn't, reboot and try again. Um, now, any game you open, I found that they run better when it's in landscape and sound. And there you go, you guys. You're running Game Boy Color or Game Boy games on your iOS device. Thanks a lot for watching. I really hope you like this video. Please comment, rate this video, and subscribe to my channel for more cool videos.